For the past 28 years, I've had the privilege of serving this community as a teacher, as a guidance counselor, as a coach, as a principal, and as a school superintendent. On June 30th of this year, uh, I will be retiring from a career that has been such a blessing to me. But I'm so fortunate and I'm so blessed now to be able to serve this community in a different capacity, pulling together two things that I'm awfully passionate about. One will be education and the other will be working towards a more inclusive community. As a lifelong resident of Spartanburg, I, I wholly believe in our goal of having one Spartanburg. I had the good privilege of serving on the board of the Spartanburg Academic Movement for many years now. And most recently, I've been proud to represent our community on the National Strive Together Board of Directors. But it is our belief that with SAM and Strive Together, that economic mobility must be grounded in educational attainment. So as we seek to move Spartanburg forward, as we seek to ensure that all of our community members you know, have access to that economic mobility, I'm proud to be taking the helm and following Dr. John Stockwell as the next executive director of the Spartanburg Academic Movement. So I know there may be those wondering, how in the world are you going to manage this work between the Spartanburg Academic Movement and the Chamber of Commerce? Well, it's simple. Now, this work goes together. Now, many of you may not know that the earliest beginnings of the Spartanburg Academic Movement were born through the efforts of the Spartanburg Area Chamber of Commerce. So here we are now, we've come full circle. And as we began to move from cradle to career with the focus on diversity, equity, inclusion and economic mobility. I am honored to be at the center of this work, working with these two vital organizations.